Sicilian Defense, Open, Classical, Richter Rosser Variation, 6, E67.QD2 A68.00OBD79.F4B510.BXF6GXF611.KB1QB612.NXC6. Wild a chaotic game where both players had many chances to win. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players threw away some big opportunities in the middle game. Both players missed some big chances in the end game. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The c pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the d4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on d4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on d4. When black eventually plays nf6, white is prevented from moving the piece to e5 by the opening of the light squared bishop on d6. d4 offers to trade the d-pawn for the c-pawn, giving up a center pawn for more active pieces. cx d4 provides black two key pawns while giving white only one. nx d4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and starts to develop on the queen side. Nc6 attacks the d4 knight and supports the e5 square. Bg5 immediately attacks the knight on f6 and prepares the possibility of queenside castling. e6 defends the d5 square and allows the dark squared bishop to develop to e7. Qd2 supports the bishop on g5 and prepares to castle queenside. A6 sets up the pawn drive at b5 and prevents the white pieces from approaching b5. 0-0-0 gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. Bd7 develops the light squared bishop, defends the knight on c6 and opens up the c8 square. f4 takes space in the center, supports the bishop on g5 and controls the e5 square. B5 takes space on the queen side and controls the c4 square. Bxf6 captures the knight on f6 and attacks the queen. Gxf6 recaptures the bishop and opens up the g file. Kb1 moves the king to a safer square and removes it from the half open c file. Qb6 develops the queen to the quia side and attacks the knight on d4. Nxc6 captures the knight. Recaptures. This threatens to kick a knight. This strikes a rival knight. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. This is the only move that works. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is the final book action. There was only one good move in that position. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a miss. This misses a chance to threaten a bishop and gain tempo. It is incorrect. This moves the knight to safety. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This ignores an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a tempo by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This buys time by putting a bishop in danger and getting it to flee. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. Backs off. It is ideal. This buys time by putting a rook in danger and getting it to flee. It is ideal. This leaves a pawn without defenders. There was only one good move there. This ignores an opportunity to defend a rook that was under attack. It is a blunder. That pawn was available for free. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. This defends the attacked knight. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is best. This leads to losing a pawn. This allows the opponent to fork pieces. It is a mistake. 
there was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. This blows the chance to fork fragments. That falls flat. This prevents the adversary from forking pieces. That's good. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to threaten winning a bishop. It is a mistake. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. That falls flat. This threatens to win a pawn. There was only one good move there. This overlooks a better way to add a defender to a vulnerable pawn. This allows the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a miss. A chance to advance a passed pawn towards promotion is lost in this. It is incorrect. This threatens to win a pawn. This allows the opponent to take an open file with a rook. It is a mistake. This is a missed chance to capture an open file with a rook. It falls flat. This misses a chance to make a rook the prize. It is incorrect. Initially, black had the upper hand, but now the score is nearly equal. It is incorrect. This enables the adversary to kick a rook. It is incorrect. A pawn kicks the opposing rook, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This takes an open file, a common method for activating a rook. This is the only good move. It is a great move. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This misses a chance to pose a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. This misses an opportunity to block an attack on a vulnerable pawn. This allows the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a mistake. This misses the chance to get a more equal position. Only one move worked there, and this wasn't it. This misses an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a bishop. It is a miss. Thus, a pawn is lost. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to win a pawn. This allows the opponent to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is a miss. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is ideal. This may succeed in winning a bishop. It is quite good. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Recaptures. This poses a threat to an open file and a rook. It is ideal. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to reveal an attack on a queen. It is a mistake. This makes winning a pawn a possibility. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. This is the only good move. This is the start of the end game and black is better. It is a great move. This could have been done lot better. It is incorrect. This provides a free pawn. It is a mistake. Although it is possible to achieve equality, this action falls short. That falls flat. This loses a pawn. This missed a move that would have produced a winning advantage. This overlooks an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is a blunder. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. Wild a chaotic game where both players had many chances to win. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players threw away some big opportunities in the middle game. Both players missed some big chances in the end game. This leads to losing a pawn. This permits the opponent to fork pieces. It is a blunder. Wild a chaotic game where both players had many chances to win. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players threw away some big opportunities in the middle game. Both players missed some big chances in the end game.